paranormal just got haunted. Where are you? We've had stuff going on. On this episode, we revisit Crank Caves. Based in St. Helens and full of strange and dark history, this was one location that we will never forget. So I'm going to see if we were connected. You trying to manifest? And the bangs again, babe? Everywhere. What was that? Hello? Come on, one big thing and then we'll leave. Throw something at us. Oh, what was that? No. no way. Join us for unseen footage as we venture deeper into the dark. He's standing right in front of me. Is there anybody here? I can hear something and I've got f not much time on my battery. I've got two minutes left on my battery. Is that you? Have you drained it? This was fully charged. We always char fully charge our equipment before we come out and this has gone down to two minutes. It's now flashing up in red. Guys, if it suddenly dies, that's why. You know why. I don't know why, but I'm also given the image of a hooded figure. Uh, I feel religion. Not in a good way. I don't think this is um, religion as we know it. I think this is dark practices. Um, I think, yes. Yes. Did you practice something dark down here? I almost want to say the word coven, as if um, a coven of witches or something like, you know, similar, um, practice things in this area. Not particularly, no, not necessarily should I say down here, but very much so around this area. And uh, that energy is strong. One of the weirdest places, and it's just drawn us back to, to investigate. It's absolutely crazy. If you know who I am, and you're communicating with me now, come and touch me. I challenge you. I'm still hearing the noises. Thank you very much. But I'm challenging you. There's like footsteps. And this is so active. But they're coming from over there. This is incredibly weird and I don't know what to make of it. One of the weirdest places I think I've ever been to. I see this man at about five foot six. Um, quite stocky build. Uh, he has a large beard. He's merely staring straight back at me. He's crossing his hands. It's like he's ringing something. What? What's that? Who are you? Are you Joe? They're throwing stones now. Joe?
Come on, stand next to me again. See if you can make that noise that you did before. Can you make that green light make a noise? What the hell? Yeah, I think he wants me out of here. I'm not budging, Joe. Show yourself to me now. I'm going to walk slowly away from you. Okay. Walk out of the darkness. Come on. In five, four, three, two, one. It's just like noises you can hear around here, yeah? Like whistles. Oh my God. It's hard to breathe. It's like um, something is in here. And also, I can smell cigarettes. Like somebody has been smoking in here. Can you give me a bit more? I'm going to film. Wow, do you see that? What was that? Thank you so much. Can you copy me? I don't know what that was. I don't know if it was a bird or birds at this time. Oh! So did you touch me on the hand? Somebody just touched this light in my hand. Somebody sort of grabbed it and the machine went off. You're getting closer to me. Can you touch this one on the on the the, the uh, mound here? You touch the aerial. Can you tell me your name before I have to go? Pardon? Huh? I can't get it. That was somebody standing right there. And that wasn't nice. Somebody just shuffled in that corner. Joe? Who's the female? Let yourself be known. Just sit quietly. That's when things start to happen. It's kind of hard to find somewhere to sit. There's just this log here. But yeah, we're gonna perch here. It's like an old style. It's not like um, you would smell like the modern day cigarette. It's like an older, older style cigarette, like a wood by anything. Thank you. Where are you? Is there, is there more than one person in here? Is that what it is? There's more than one of you. It is so dark, guys. I just can't believe how dark it is. It, if I go back, right, you'll see. It gets lighter, okay? And as soon as you go, look, look. As soon as you go into the darkness, there's something there. I mean, you just wait until the rest of this investigation. What else is waiting for us? Can you tell me your name? Just can't pick up anything, it's just moans. Guys, I really am. Thank you so much. As you can see, whoever is here is uh, communicating. They're willing to communicate as well. Uh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to shut this one down because I have no battery left and it's just flashing up with an empty battery sign. <laughs> There's no more blocks left. Um, guys, it's been amazing, and we've had so much happen in this one. Thank you so much for setting my machines off. Can you whistle one more time? 